Good morning, DP. It's Josh, and I will be doing this week's Wednesday announcements. Calling all juniors, please fill out this QR code, which is regarding school events and activities. Today is a special day for a certain sophomore. Happy birthday to Carlo Anderson. Now let's talk about sports. Yesterday, girls volleyball played at home versus Oxnard, and they were able to pull out with the win 3-0. They are now 3-1 in league and 6-6 overall. Today, boys beach volleyball plays at home versus Santa Barbara at 3 p.m. Last week, girls flag football played against Buena. Before we go, here's a video from Aiden Myers, Brody Shelker, Finn Spock, Jonathan Harling, Rocky Toman, and Sam Mitchell to tell you how it went. I'm Aiden Myers. I'm at Scott O'Leary Stadium right now, and tonight our girls flag football team takes on the Buena Bulldogs. Our girls are currently 1-0 after beating Bishop Diego last week. Starting the first half strong, the girls pulled two touchdowns while keeping a strong defense. It's now halftime and our girls are beating the Bulldogs in an electric 13-0. The girls are doing amazing tonight. Staying strong in the second, our Chargers managed another two touchdowns, and Buena scored one at the end of the game, making it the first point allowed on defense. The girls' flag football has just won their second game against the Buena Bulldogs. The score is 25-6, to and it was an amazing game to watch. Yeah. Taylor, this atmosphere tonight was a little bit different than last week's. How do you think you played to the advantage of that? Um, we definitely came out with a strong attitude, and I think we were there for each other and saw all we needed. And this is your second blowout win. First against the Cardinals, now against the Bulldogs. How confident are you in this year's skills? Um, we're definitely confident, but we definitely need to put in some more work, but we do have the confidence. So. All right, thank you, Taylor. Good luck to next week's game. I'm here at Buena High School today where the Chargers are taking on the Buena Bulldogs. Last year, the Chargers played the Bulldogs but lost the game 35-14. to Today, they'll be looking for a different outcome. Today will also be the first start of junior quarterback Gonzo Murillo, and he should be having a great performance. Let's go, Chargers, and let's win the game. It's halftime here in Buena. The Chargers are down 22 to 6, and the rushing game has worked very, very well again. We'll see how the rest of the game plays out and how the Chargers can come back. Well, unfortunately, the Chargers couldn't pull away with the win against the Bulldogs, losing 39 to 12. The rushing game worked well over the course of the game, but we couldn't pull through with the win. We'll see you guys in two weeks at home versus Ventura. This has been Josh Conner reporting for DP News. I'm here at Sovine Stadium, and the girls are about to face off against the Oxnard Yellow Jackets at 6.30. Let's get it, girls. The girls started off strong, winning the first set 25-21. They carried this momentum into the second set, winning 25-22 with help from hard hitter Layla McQuicken, ending with 9 kills, 7 digs, and 4 aces. The Chargers have just won their third set, 25 to 18, and have swept the Oxnard Yellow Jackets. Way to go, girls, and can't wait to see you on Thursday night against Santa Barbara.